The Fairview fire has forced many people to evacuate their homes, including the principal of La Quinta High School, who had to leave his home in Anza. News Channel 3's Miriam Bouchot spoke with him about his main concerns when it came to evacuating. These are the evening skies Dr. Rudy Wilson usually enjoys from his home in Anza. But the Fairview fire quickly filled his horizon with smoke and the glow of the flames. Never in my 15 years of living up there, we've never been evacuated. So that was unusual. He is the principal of La Quinta High School, making the nearly hour-long commute daily from Anza. Even though wildfires often spark near his home, this is his first evacuation order. Police officers placed a mandatory evacuation in his area late Thursday night. What they did is they stood at the fence of my property and used their loudspeaker to announce that it's a mandatory evacuation and I noticed that they went up and down the street and they pretty much did the same thing. His family went to stay with relatives in the Coachella Valley. However, Wilson chose to stay behind despite the mandatory evacuation order. You had a lot of looting um, because people were evacuating and so even though police they showed a presence they still had uh, several homes that were looted because of the fires on saturday three people were found and arrested for stealing from residences inside the evacuated properties i wanted to make certain that with the evacuation order that I could do whatever I needed to do to protect my property, and fortunately, we were fine. Wilson left his home Friday morning, evacuation lasting about 24 hours total. He has since been able to return safely to his home. By no means is it a wealthy community, so not everyone has the resources to just on a heartbeat evacuate, especially if they have livestock or if they live in areas which is a little bit tougher to get out of. I was fearful for my neighbors. Wilson was especially worried for the safety of his older neighbors. My neighbors, I, I will certainly keep in my in my mind a little bit more hoping that next time he can be better prepared to help anyone in need my takeaway is this just be kind to your neighbors and check in on your neighbors once in a while the the material stuff you can replace the lives you can't in la quinta marion bouchot news channel 3.